Hello, hello. Oh, I just got up from a little rest. I don't think I took a nap or anything, but I exhausted myself because today was the 100 Good Women Annual Clothing Exchange, and I asked off work so I could volunteer um, because they encourage you to shop as you're bringing in all the clothes. So the community brings in all the clothes. There's Sunny, sniffing my new shoes. Um, the community brings in all their clothes donations and then you shop and everything's a dollar. Um, so it's a lot of fun. And I had a budget and I went in under my budget. So, but I got some fun stuff, so I thought I'd go through. It's a mess. I don't have any order to this, so I'll just start grabbing, and, you know, if I need to say something about it, I'll say something. So, I'll just start. This is my haul. Everything a buck. So, this is, uh, you know, if I know the brand, I'll tell you, because some of the stuff I did buy just for brand um, to sell, but... But this is Land's End, and I mean, I've never really met a Paisley that I didn't like, so I got it. I thought it was cool. It's like super enlarged Paisley. So, I like that design. This was like one of my favorite things. Maybe I should have saved it for last, but I did not. Because I actually met the woman that donated this. But it is like an authentic marching band top it um, has um it's from bellmaster corporation um and she said it just got a little bit too tight for her and she used it every year for the mardi gras parade and i said well that's you know that was kind of my thought but i mean check those bellowy sleeves out the ribbon work i mean i've i've wanted one of these for a long time if you know you know right and you know paisley paisley i love and i love fringe too i try not to get anything too i don't know but that's a nice little suede dress, long fringe. Fun. Um, this shirt I almost put in the go back um, because before I buy everything, I go through everything, and you know, I, although I don't like the Murray Kondo, does it bring you joy? I just, you know, I need to go through just in case there's something. I don't want to have buyer's regret for a dollar a piece. Um, but embroidered, somebody hand embroidered, there's all flowers, gosh, I don't even know what's on here, a partridge, let's just take a moment, oh, a bunny and a carrot, sunset, and a palm tree and snails and for some reason an anchor well maybe they're going with the the beach theme the sleeves are nice and then it's got this little doily lace they're actually little hearts so lightweight that denim color cotton um i got a couple of just nice t-shirts can wear to work Summer's coming. Guess I went on the blue stripe theme. This a friend gave to me because it was a little tight on her. Said, do you like this? And it's the North. Yeah, North Face. And it's like a purpley pink fur. And... A darker purple outer, quilted outer, North Face little jacket. And I have to stand up for this one. So it's a nice, it's thin, thin suede. Oh, 
coat. That's a little duster, if you will. So, a dollar. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry about the umbrella. That's my meditation chair, so I'm, I'm not going ahead and hang this up. So I'm meditating on my finds today. Um, I got this little purse. It's a relic. And it's got little llamas on it. So no problem llama. No problem llama. No drama llama. I got this scarf because it's um, Italian silk. It's from Italy. Little hearts and polka dots. Oh, and I got a couple of card games, and these were a dollar originally, but I picked them up because I had a seven-year-old um, here at my house yesterday, and lo and behold, I have nothing that interests a seven-year-old boy. So I thought, you know, if nothing else, I can have the have crazy eights and old maid in the house. That might be an old grandma type of thing, but nonetheless, they won't take up very much room and it's kid appropriate. Got a couple of uh, black strappy platforms. I opened up this box, so I put it out and I looked at it and I said, oh, those are fancy. I'm gonna have to get those. I got a few laughs, but they're gold lame. And let's see, they're delicacy brand. I don't know anything about them. And then I have like diamonds, gold, diamondy shoes. So I have a couple of outfits those would go with. And then I got one formal, you know, just in case I get invited to the gala event. Um, it's a silver. There was a rack that had all uh, rhinestone formals. So for those of you that think I'm obsessive, my daughters, um, I only got one and it's like classy. It's like silver, sparkly comes with a little short thing. I do have a wedding to attend this summer, but I don't know if this would be wedding appropriate or not, but you know, it's pretty and it was a dollar. <laughs> well, this next thing is, I think my favorite find, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna move it to the side and save it for last. I got a zip up hoodie sweater looks very roomy so it may pass that on as a hood but you know had to get that this one's cool too let's see if it's not hooked to anything yeah I got this don't you like it it is clothes pinned onto the hanger and I had it all packed nice and then they have to like unpack everything and they were just kind of shoving them in because they count them before you get to the part where you pay so you just give them your little sticky note of how many items you have and pay that amount. Mine was 40. So you know only 30 more to go guys. Or folks, but look at that. Flowery string shirt. Yeah. I mean, I'm hoping my friends have like little potlucks and stuff. I got a couple of ties. I just went through the ties just to look at um, brands. So forgive me. Uh, Versace. And Gucci, Gucci, <laughs> um, this is 
fly, what do you call those, flies for fishing? It has fishing flies on it, but. Um, these are heeled tennis shoes, but they're Michael Kor. I haven't tried them on yet, but they look like the tread hasn't been walked walked out of the store. So I guess they're a lifter. I don't have to look these up, but they're Michael Kor tennis shoes. Well, I got swimmy souped and I looked to make sure it wasn't nasty. Just in case. And I can't tell you the last time I had a swimsuit on. So, but, you know, I really liked it. Um, it's got little, like, Hawaiian flowers on it. So, again, it looks brand new. I don't see a tag, but... I should have probably left that in there. This is a fun dress too. I did a snack and someone caught me at it. They go, oh, that's a cool dress. I go, oh, did you want it? And they go, oh no, I didn't want it. But I, you know, if you've got good taste, I go, well, you see, you saw my snagging technique. So Halloween dress with a, with a Ouija board. And it has um, the moon down on the bottom. Another silk scarf. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful. It's a Gucci. I really like this one. It's got um, tighters. It's got a little koala. A little cat. Snails. That is really pretty. So thank you whoever donated that. This is says one continenti or I continenti. My Italian is so good. <laughs> All right, that is about it out of that box. There's a couple of things in there, but we're gonna pass on those. Another fun dress alert. This one has dinosaurs on it. I don't know what it is, but peach love, peach love, all in California. Cute, cute. I thought this was a Lily Pilzer or however you say her name. So I kind of, I saw it across the room as you would be seen from across the room if you, if you were to don it, but it is not. It is a London Times still. It's nice, isn't it? A little psychedelic there for you. Some of my favorite colors in there, orange and pink. Oh, and let's continue on with the cool dresses that I found. Cause I can't pass up flamingos or dinosaurs or Halloween or you'll see my last one, but these are flamingos, sunny girl. And it has a little zipper plunge back. So that's cool. So I guess I got everything that had animal print on it. Here's a more natural dress. Rising International. It has um, fabric, fabric remnants on it. And embroidery, these flowers are embroidered on elastic waist, nice material. Oh, flowers on the bottom. So 
So, artsy natural looking dress there. Leather purse that is would match. I'd have to wear those together. I don't know what purse this is, but it feels like leather. Um, it has a martini glass on it. And then it has this, I had a hard time like snapping it because I wanted to snap it going across, but it like plunges down um, and it's divided into two main pockets with pockets inside. So thanks whoever donated that. I kind of like that. Oh, and to continue on the Michael Kors theme here. A little wallet, gold, lame, you know. That's nice. I got a functional belt just because. I like it because it's got holes every every half inch. So depending on, you know, if you're wearing boyfriend pants or mom pants or whatever pants and whatever where they sit on you, you'll be able to find that right adjustment and then a couple pieces of jewelry um i got this coat and it was necessity because i had a light sweater on with my clothes but it got a little chilly because it got cloudy we're in a, a, a freeze warning it's like 70 during the day and then at night freeze warning so i got this puffer lightweight puffer jacket it's h and m so I'm pretty happy with that because it fits me to a T. It's like it was tailored. And I'm kind of picky about my coats because I have so many of them, but I bought two more. So I got those. And then, oh, this punk bracelet with pink studs and rhinestones. I wore that today with my outfit because it went with my outfit. I'm tripping over my platforms there. And then these leather casual shoes, pink. And the, and there goes my mountain of clothes. I've got a brass bangle that has the word peace in all different languages so and this bracelet has a scorpio in it i don't know if it's real or not but i think it's a scorpio and that's what i am surprise and um so it's like a leather strap bracelet has that Scorpio in it so oh and then my favorite my favorite out my favorite outfit that today and it's the last one um, that I got is a dress to continue on the animal theme and oh ho, ho, you guys don't be mad I worked hard for five hours straight, I did the intake of clothes and put them out on racks and it was just so much fun. But a cat dress <laughs> with the collar, with the sweet little collar. Yeah. Anyway, some I will keep, some I will sell and some I will give away um but that's just how it goes i had fun and i was called i got a title today um three people agreed when one person said it that were standing around me and they go oh you're miss enabler and i'm called what do you mean and i go you're the one that goes around and says oh now look fantastic on you oh it's a good crap cause it's only a dollar but it is a good cause because they buy um things like beds and clothing and kitchen items for 
people that are leaving bad domestic environments. Um, the group is a, it's a local group. It's a hundred good women. They do a couple fundraisers, um, a year and they're active on Facebook and, um, they do a lot of good in our community and you know, our community comes out because I got some good stuff. What can I say? All right. Have a good day. Go do good.